you're not looking at an outtake from the whip set, this is Tokyo Extreme Racer Drift for the PS2. The game's laughable story mode is set in the year 20XX AD. According to the dull text scroll that kicks off the threadbare plot, the use of mountain roads in various areas has declined due to newly constructed bypasses. They were closed for a long time and thereby lost their purpose. That's an exciting way to kick off your game. It's about as thrilling as the introduction of the first Mario Brothers game, where we learned that the brothers were put out of business due to public municipality ordinance number 72406. Fortunately, the automobile selection is great. Thanks to the licensed cars, you can choose to tear up the streets with tons of sweet rides, like the Audi TT Coupe Quattros, new Beetles, and yes, even the Mini Cooper. Once you have your wheels, you can run practice races during the day that let you earn money for ride pimping. But why did the makers of Tokyo Extreme Racer Drift stop at rims and halogen headlights? At the very least, they could have thrown in some fuzzy dice or maybe a vanity license plate. At night, you challenge rivals to fast and furious downhill races where you're judged on your drifting skills as well as your speed. However, you never get to actually see any of your rivals. In fact, you won't get to see anybody since your interactions take place via text messages that appear on screen. But the fun doesn't stop there. You can also log onto the in-game message board and check out interesting topics like this posting from your friend Nobu Wakamatsu. Want to discuss environmental protection through ecological racing with me? It's almost as fascinating as our message boards. Why do they make Adam act like a retard? I mean, the stuff he does is not funny. I watch it and I want to hit him. Wow, that guy's mean. Or how about this pearl of wisdom? You just got pwned, topic person. Our biggest complaint with Tokyo Extreme Racer Drift is the far from intuitive control. No matter how expensive they are, all of your rides control like shopping carts with two bad wheels. What makes the game even less impressive is that you can only race against one other car at a time. The game is pretty, but with only a handful of courses to choose from, you'll be begging for fresh scenery faster than you can say Formula D. Tokyo Extreme Racer Drift gets a two out of five. You know what? STFU noob. LOL. ROTFL. You just got pwned, topic person. You really need to let go of all this aggression you have for the forums. Hate leads to anger. Anger leads to suffering. Suffering leads to the dark side. Cool. It sounds all cool now, but next thing you know, you're killing children and having your arms burned off by lava. Cool. 